Hello! In my previous video, I showed you the test. I just decided to make it a little bit more clear for you. We've got five answers, right? Letters. A is dramatic, extremely young. All that sharpness, angular, tall, long, lean, all those features stand for A. B is natural. All that squarish, blunt, muscular go for B. If you have most answers of B, then you're probably natural, right? Then we have C. C is classic. So softness in, and sharpness are mixed so much in a blender. You are moderate. You're something in between. So if you have most of the answers C, then you're classic, probably. Then if you have D. D is basically a theatrical romantic. This is that tricky part of that test because I heard that somewhere he said that D is for stands for theatrical romantic. It's meaning the romantic roundness, softness with some delicate sharpness in it. So this is a separate thing. D theatrical romantic. E is softness, 100% softness, roundness, petite, blushy, hourglass, soft and all those features. And so gamin is 50% of A, extreme sharpness, 50% of E, extreme softness. So logically you can now see, for example, if most of your answers are C and some of answers like a B or A, then probably you have your classic but with some drama in it, with some sharpness. Or, for example, if you have most of your answers of B, if you're natural, but you have several answers of D or E, D or E is pretty much softness over there. So you probably might think that you're natural with some softness in it. It's not a 100% thing, it's just, uh, it's just a tendency. I'm going to give you one little example. Uh, celebrities, famous people, models, anyone can have great photos. If you have a lot of makeup on yourself, if your hair is made, if you're dressed up in very beautiful clothes, you have a great camera, you have great lighting, it basically doesn't matter what type you are because you can make yourself look great, even in wrong lines, believe it or not. All that thing kind of creates a totally new body. But we're talking about us walking on the streets, about us working somewhere about us going out with a friends for example if you see that celebrity like that just in front of you walking or you can compare her to other people then we really need to know about those lines there's an example people say that Beyonce and Tyra Banks are look alike what types are they are they same type no they are extremely different types Tyra Banks is soft dramatic She's heavier in bones, she's taller, she looks more massive, and Beyonce is romantic. She's more petite, she's more delicate. Even though she has those very soft arms and legs, she looks lighter than Tyra Banks. If we see them together, we can kind of see that Tyra Banks have much stronger bone structure and skeleton and stature than Beyonce. And sometimes it may not be so obvious. But it is making a huge difference. Hope it was helpful. See you very soon. Bye!